Can you guys hear me? Yes or no? Can you guys hear me? Yes or no? All right, I want us to start off by giving a couple of shout outs real quick. Shout out to, to Marlon for hosting that debate. Even though Marlon knows that I cannot stand the doctrine of Calvinism, he allows me to debate the topic against other Calvinists. So shout out to him. And I wanted to give a shout out to somebody named Jose. Jose is a guy that when I was 18, 19 years old, he was an excellent debater. He wasn't of the faith, but he could just debate anything. This guy was very, very talented. And I learned a lot from that man. See, somebody doesn't have to be a Christian. You can learn from anybody. That guy was a monster debater. Monster, monster debater. So, you know, there you have that. I wanted to give Jose a shout out. I don't want to say his last name, but he was probably one of the greatest debaters I've ever met. And he used to slap me around. And instead of getting upset, I started taking notes. I say, yo, this guy's kind of nasty with it. And I took a lot of his tactics. So there you have it. Uh, special shout out to Jose. So, yeah. Maybe I'm going to bring him on the channel one day and we can talk about God and chop it up because I don't think he's a believer and that would be a good conversation. All right. So, fellas, real quickly, I want I want to play a quick video real quick. There's there's a couple of videos. So let me tell you what's going on with Sam. Let me tell you what's going on with Sam. The man is angry at me and he's like a Democrat. Sam Shamoon is like a Democrat. Sam Shamoon is going around saying that I'm calling Mary a whore. Because I believe that Mary had sex in marriage after Jesus. So now he's going around saying that that means that Mary is a whore or that I'm saying Mary is a whore. He's a Democrat. And this guy goes around calling people fat and everything like that. Brother, you're not necessarily the slimmest one in the group, brother. You're not necessarily the slimmest dude. Let's get that straight. And it's, it's hard to debate and argue with Sam Shamoon because he doesn't play with the rules of a Christian. Fellas, I'm going to play all the videos. I got all the videos here. I got everything. Sam Shamoon doesn't play. Sam Shamoon doesn't play with the rules of a Christian. If you go Sam Shamoon, your argument is bad. He'll go, your mother's a whore. So it doesn't, it's not the same. You know what I'm saying? This is why Kelly will never win, right? Because while Kelly is, is being an affable Christian, while Anthony Rogers is being a Christian, this guy will take it up a notch and call your mother a whore. So he's, he's playing games by the secular standards, right? So I'm being a Christian. Hey, brother, can I ask you? No, your mom's a whore. You're a bastard. You're this, you're that, you're that. So it's not the same game, right? Like it's almost like he has guns and I got rubber bullets. Because in Christianity, right, we're, we're supposed to be calm, timid, and act as Christians. Not just act, we're supposed to be Christians. So while I'm shooting with rubber gun, because if I were to roast Sam Shamoon, Sam Shamoon would never recover. I'm from New York City. I would, I would send Sam Shamoon crying. A roasting battle, if Jesus, if Jesus were to say, hey, JP, I'm going to give you 30 minutes. You can say whatever you want. 30 minutes, and I'm not going to hold it against you because the Bible says for every idle word that you give, you will be held accountable. But if God said, JP, just for these 30 minutes, I will allow you to say anything you want about Sam Shumun for 30 minutes. All right? Brother, how dare you, brother? I'm not from New York. Oh, you're trolling. You're trolling. All right, cool. 30 minutes, he won't win. But because I'm a Christian, I hold back. I, I hold back. I mean, this man's walking around with titties calling other people fat. You see, that's the direction I'd go. Big titty Sam Shamoon, but I'm a Christian. You see? So he plays another game. He plays another game, right? And that's what he does. He thinks he's a tough man because he talks to Christians. Yo, do I have something on my beard, man? 
That's what I'm saying. See, everybody's already laughing at this man. Imagine if I had 30 minutes. Yo, fellas, this is my boy Jose right here. This is my boy Jose. Hopefully he comes on the channel. We can all talk to him about Jesus because this is my boy. He helped me out when I was a very young man. He's not a believer, but he really did help me out. But look at how you guys are already laughing. Look at how you guys are already laughing. Imagine I had 30 minutes. I had 30 minutes without without a without any kind of boundaries. I would murder Sam Shamu, metaphorically speaking, in a roast battle. But because I'm above reproach, I cannot go down that level. Right? I can't go down that level. But he does it because he takes advantage of Christians. That's what he does. And he's a Democrat. Right? Sam Shamoon is a Democrat because I never called Mary a hoe. So when I'm going to play you guys this video, I'm going to play the, the, you guys a couple of videos. All right? This is what I'm saying. Big titty Sam Shamoon. And there's much more. And there's much more that I have that I can say. Like, I have like a million. I actually tell my personal friends the jokes that I could tell them if we ever got in a roasting battle. Like, 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 bro, it would go very, very bad. Very, very bad. You know what I'm saying? This man's going around calling people fat. And this is the most, the most out of shape slob I ever seen in my life. Calling people fat. How you fat calling other people fat? I think this is Sam Shamoon right here on the burner account. Because the same account came. So look, this is how Sam Shamoon's people act. You see? So I'm operating by the rules of a Christian. And Sam Shamoon is here on the burner account making comments like this. You see what they do? And if it's not Sam Shamoon, Sam Shamoon makes comments like that all the time. He'll make comments like that all the time. So you see what kind of nasty man he is. All right. Now look at this fool over here. Look at this fool. Yo, fool. I was trying to have an honest debate, fool. I was trying to have an honest debate. So let me get you out of here. Let me get you out of here. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. All right. So I'm going to show you why that guy's a fool in a bit. I'm going to show you guys why he is. Because he, I'm, I'm going to show you. I got all the receipts here. I got all the receipts. All right, fellas? So I'm going to show you all the receipts. And I'm going to show you the proof that big titty Sam Shamoon is bugging out. All right? All right? So let's, let's, let, let's, let's go real quick. I mean, this guy's a Democrat. I wish he could have an affable and edifying conversation, but name calling is almost exactly. But again, Sam plays by other rules. So if you're a Christian, you can't play that game. You can't play that game, right? Because it's not Christ-like. So if I wanted to, I could play that game. But I'm a Christian, so I can't go around giving him the same energy he gives me. The Bible says, pray for your enemies. Don't call their mother whores. That's what the Bible doesn't say. Call somebody a whore because they have a different theological position from you. The Bible simply doesn't say that. All right. So, fellas, let me tell you when this all started. All right. So this guy is on Praise I Am's channel. Praise I Am's channel. Right. And he's on Praise I Am's channel and he's breaking down the Trinity. So I show up on Praise I Am's channel. I show up on Praise I Am's channel. And I wrote a comment. Sam uses enemy tactics. That doesn't work on me. You know what I'm saying? That doesn't work on me. Shout out to Jose. I was well trained. I was very well trained, fellas. All that name calling and trying to dominate the conversation, that doesn't work on me. That It just doesn't work. All right. So I was on Praise This Channel. Sam Shimon was there. Sam Shimon was there. And he was breaking down the Trinity, and I write a comment to praise. I go praise, because I, I love praise, right? Praise is one of my homies. He's a free gracer, but I have a personal relationship outside of YouTube, and we have conversations all the time. So I go on praise this channel, minding my own business, right? I mind my own business. Let me show you guys. Let me see if I can share my screen.
So boom. So here it is. I'm minding my business on Praise's channel, minding my business. And I go, I go, yo, Praise. I said, yo, Praise, what's good? And look, immediately, immediately, this guy manifests. No self-control. I didn't even address Sam Shimon. Look. James, I hope you got your answer. And JP Uncut, contact me on Skype so we can go live on my channel. Don't hide behind Marlon. Second. All right. So look, there he starts once again, once again. James, I hope you got your answer. And JP Uncut, contact me on Skype so we can go live on my channel. Don't hide behind Marlon. I mean, brother, when he asked that, this is all. I, this is what I said. This is what I said. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. <laughs> Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. That's what. Right. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. Right. If you're going to talk crazy like that, sign the contract. Right. So let's carry on. Let's carry on. All right. So as you guys can see, this is my Facebook. Obviously, we're there. OK, so now. Praise this. Praise is silly. But now we're going to have an after show on Praise's channel, by the way, after this. So as you guys can see, I was minding my own freaking business. And this man's going to take a shot at me saying, stop hiding behind Marlon. Now, you may ask, who is Marlon? Who is Marlon? You may ask. That's a very good question. Well, I will show you guys who Marlon is. So let me show you guys who Marlon is. Where the heck is Marlon? Why does Hercules pop up every time I type gospel truth? It's so dang annoying, man. Marlon, you got to figure that out. Every time I type gospel truth on YouTube, I get bombarded with Hercules clips, brother. Like, what's going on here, Marlon? Every single time, brother, this is what pops up. Hercules, brother. Hercules. Can you get to the bottom of this, Marlon? What the heck is this? Mighty hurt. In the story, we are the muses, goddesses of the arts, and flame. That's crazy, Marlon. You got to get this fixed. Anyways, there he is. There he. Is. I gotta go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven videos down to get to Marlon. That's ridiculous. Anyway, here's Marlon. All right, it's not associated with Hercules. Okay, fellas, he's not associated with Hercules. So Marlon is a channel where debates are hosted. I told Sam Shamoon, run me a fair one on the Marian doctrines on the gospel truth. He goes, no, 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 no. I want you to come on my channel. I want you to come on my channel, JP. Well, I'm going to show you guys what happens when you go on his channel. Because I took him on that offer. This guy is a lying, may the Lord guard my mouth. This man is, is uh, a little dishonest, fellas. This man's a little dishonest. So anyways, I told Marlon, I said, Marlon, set up the debate. But Sam Shamoon doesn't want a neutral platform. What he wants is what I'm going to show you happened okay i'm gonna show you guys what happened okay fellas so this is me i that had a debate be accountable for that and i don't know i had a work. debate here against uh this brother here named oscar we may actually work on some projects together so we had a debate it was a battle of the light skins and brown skins you know what i'm saying light skin versus brown skins you know the ultimate battle right here you know what i'm saying light skin brothers versus the, the brown skin brothers who will win you know what i'm saying that's what we had there fellas and guess what? It was a good debate. We had an excellent discussion and we shared our point of views. You know what I'm saying? And I don't I don't think it's about winning or losing because some people here said I won. Some people here said I lost. But it's about sharing your position. And then the audience has to come to their own conclusion. All right, fellas. So that was that. We had a debate here. And, uh, you know, I said. In, in the last statements, I said that there are people. There are people that have a lot of knowledge, but they don't have fruits of the spirit. So I don't know if that's what made Sam Shamoon manifest, but it couldn't have been because it was a general statement. Right. 
I said in the debate, I said there are people that know the Bible from front to back. And they have issues with their character. So I don't know if that's what made Sam uh, manifest. But I have debates on this channel. And I have another debate. Here's my other debate that I'm going to have. Right here. Another debate. Does Calvinism teach a different gospel? What, I mean, look at that. I'm out here debating. This. Nobody does this, by the way. Nobody has the cojones to take a debate like this. Because it, I believe it is easier to prove that Calvinism is not a different gospel than to prove that it is a different gospel. But I took it. I actually talked to the guy I'm debating because we, we became acquainted uh, because this debate was scheduled months in advance. So he reached out to me. He actually came on my channel and I talked to Marlon pretty frequently. I'd say every week I talk to Marlon or every other day we exchange a text message. Well, me and Marlon, we talk a lot. We're in a group chat together with another person that's of high influence. I'm not going to say any names, but we talk a lot and he's a Calvinist and we disagree. We, we really disagree. But nobody calls nobody's mother a whore and we don't go that distance. All right. So there you have it. All right, fellas. And this is the guy that Sam says I hide behind. He says, oh, you're hiding behind this guy. What do you mean I'm hiding behind this guy? This is a neutral platform. And by the way, did you know that your own teammate debates on this platform as well? Right here. This is this is this is William. William is on Sam Shamoon's channel all the time. So if William can debate here, why can't I debate here? This is William. That's William. All right. And now I want to change the debate. The debate is going to be this. This is what I want the debate to be. Is Mary a whore if she were to have sex with her husband? That's going to be the debate. Before I wanted to debate, is the Marian doctrines biblical? That's what I wanted to debate. Right. But now I don't want to debate that anymore. Now I want to debate, does a woman having sex with her husband biblically prove that she is a whore? That's what I want to debate now. All right? So that's the debate, fellas. You, 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 you hear me? I want to debate, is Mary a whore if she had sex with her husband? Her husband. Sam will never take that debate. Oh, I, I would love to debate that. Is Mary a whore for, for sleeping with her husband? All right. Okay, so now let's carry on. So now let's get to this right here. Let's get to this right here. People are blowing up my phone. All right. People, nobody ever hits me up when I'm not live. But when I'm live, everybody hits me up. Everybody. JP, how are you doing? Uh. You know, uh, JP this, JP that. You know, what is this? All right. So now we're going to play this right here. And Sam, don't bother deleting it because I downloaded the video. So if you want to delete it, go ahead. But I, I already downloaded the video. And this is fair use. All right. So, fellas, now we're going to press play on this. And you're going to see the debate and discussion that we had. The man lies on my name and he says that I'm scared. He says that I ran from a mentally disabled person, which is pretty disgusting. The Sam Shamoon would use a mentally ill person for leverage. For context, there's this guy. I'm not going to say his name. He's mentally ill. He, he, he's, in a, he's on another level, fellas. He's mentally ill. Now, I think Sam Shamoon is mentally ill, but not mentally ill like this guy is mentally ill. I think Sam Shimon is mentally ill because things happened in his personal life. And I'll leave it there. I'll leave it there. I don't have to get personal. That's for him to share. And he's shared it before, but I just don't want to go family. I mean, he called my mother a whore. But again, I don't play those games, right? He can play them. I don't play them. You got to be above reproach, right? This is why Kelly Powers will never beat Sam Shimon because Kelly Powers is being respectful and then he's getting cursed out in the other end of the aisle. So that it's it's an unfair fight. It's an unfair fight. But again, I'm not going to stoop to that level. And I'll, I'll do what Kelly Powers does, right? We're just going to keep it Christian. Anyways.
Oh, yes. So the mentally ill person, the mentally ill person. Yes. So there's a mentally ill person that I debated. We had a debate and he pretty much got cooked. It was on deliverance. So it was a debate. Me and this mentally ill person had a debate on deliverance. I destroyed him and he manifested. So yesterday I went on Praise This Channel and I was talking why you should not make videos on this stuff. 105 people watching, 19 likes. Uh, smack that like for sure. Th fellas, definitely hit a like. Hit a like. So anyways... Not everybody who posts videos on YouTube is mentally healthy. All right, fellas? And this particular person is mentally ill. And there are many mentally ill people on YouTube. This is why I stay away. I stay away. There's a lot of people I don't talk to. There's a lot of mentally ill people on YouTube. And they make videos on me, but I understand they're mentally ill. So I had a debate with this guy. He lost. He started manifesting. He came back, tried again, came back, tried again. And I used that example to explain how he was mentally ill on Praise I Am's channel yesterday. Well, here we have Sam Shamoon saying, well, JP, you ran from this guy. You ran from him. Ran? Ran where? I pulled up on your channel. <laughs> I almost said something I shouldn't have said, but I'm a Christian. I pulled up on your channel, Sam. If I didn't run from you, I'm not running from that guy who is mentally ill. He's sick. He's sick in the head. This is why I have not made a single video. And when I was on Praise's channel, I told everybody on Praise's channel, I said, do not make any videos on this guy. He's not mentally well. This guy will go on at 2 in the morning and read the church fathers from 2 in the morning to 8 in the morning like a darn robot. This guy will stream for 24 hours. He's not, he's, he's, he doesn't talk right. He's, he's not mentally well. This is why I said on Praise's channel, even if he makes a million videos on me, I will not respond. He's mentally sick. All right? He's mentally sick. So when somebody's mentally sick, you got to leave them alone. And that's what I said. And so Mr. Sammy Boy... Big Titty Sam Shamoon is going to go around talking about, well, JP, you ran from that guy. That guy's mentally sick, bro. And I did debate him on deliverance. All right? So th this is the situation at hand. So look at this. So I go on Sam Shamoon's channel. I go on Big Titty's uh, channel, right? Big Titty's. And I go on Big Titty's channel and I'm like, yo, let me see what the heck, let me see what the heck is going on here, right? I go, let me see what's going on, right? Because I'm like, yo, why is this man, why is this man beefing with me? Every time he gets an opportunity, he takes a shot at me. I'm not taking, in fact, I told Sam Shamoon that I loved them on Praise's channel. I said, Sam, I love you, man. I love you, too. All right? I said that. I said, Sam, I love you, too. But this guy, the demons in this guy, the demons, they manifest. You know what I'm saying? They, they manifest in ways that, that you can't even imagine. All because I said, let's have a debate. This is how this starts. I said, let's debate the Marian doctrines. Your mother is a whore. That's unhinged behavior. How have you been, man? Haven't seen you since 125. Oh, man, what the heck? What a small world, bro. I knew this guy when I was in sixth grade. How the heck did you find this channel? That's crazy. I knew that guy when I was in sixth grade. What a small world. All right. So anyways, it's interesting. I knew that guy at sixth grade and I knew Jose when I was 18, 19 years old. So that's that's pretty crazy. But anyways, let's let's carry on. Let's carry on. All right. Glory to God. Glory to God, brother. All right. Let's carry on. Look at this real quick. So, JP, shut your mouth and listen before I come after you, because, you know, I don't like you because you bark a lot. You ran to Marlon Wilson. I ran to Marlon Wilson, who is a 
neutral moderator. Neutral moderator. That's who I ran to. Because I want a neutral platform. But I said, forget all that. I pulled up on your channel, big boy. I pulled up on you. I pulled up on you, big boy. What you think? You thought this was all sweet over here, brother? I pulled up on you, brother. You think I'm scared of you, brother? And brother, look, if you want to do a UFC fight, we could do UFC, brother. You know what I'm saying? We could do UFC. If you want to if you want to fight me, brother, let's sign a contract and let's do UFC. We'll do UFC. We don't got to do boxing. Let's do UFC. But we got to sign a contract. Obviously, there's not a, a, a chance in hell you'll do it because Muhammad Hijab told you that if you want to debate me, you'd have to do a UFC fight and you never signed the contract. What you think? I forgot, big boy. What you thought I forgot? That's why the debate never happened. So you talk all crazy, but you're not really like that. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. Let's find the video real quick. Let's find that video real quick. Let's, we got to play it one more time for him. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. Hold on. Let's find that. Let me find that real quick. Let me find that. Let me find that real quick. Where's where's that video? Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. There it is. There it is. There we go. I found it, fellas. I found it. There we are. Okay. So, Sam Shamoon, if you want to do a UFC fight against me, brother, let's do UFC style. Me and you, one-on-one, -on -one, brother. Let's go. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. <laughs> Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. If you're okay with calling my mother a whore, then you have no issues with doing a little UFC sparring. Let's go. UFC, brother. YouTube would love to see me versus you in a UFC fight, brother. They would love that. All right, brother, I'm talking sports, fellas. I'm talking sports. All right. I never said I wanted to fight Sam Shamoon. I said I would like to do a I would like to do a UFC fight. That's what I'm saying. I would like to do a UFC fight. Choke holds and all that stuff. If if you can. That's funny. Somebody said I'm telling Pagani. That's funny. But if if you can, if you can call somebody's mother a whore like that and he. Sam is a liar. He'll probably be like, oh, I'll fight you. I'll do it. He'll never sign the contract. He'll never sign the contract. All right? So if he wants to if he wants to go blow for blow, we could do a little UFC fight, submissions, all that. I would love to. I would love nothing more. And, oh, before you say, oh, JP, this and that, if somebody can call your mother a whore, they should be willing to do that. All right? All right, let's carry on. So, fellas, I want to show you this real quick. I want to show you guys this real quick. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. All right. Sign the contract. People, and you know, let me let me let me address some people. Let me address some people. You got people out here saying, oh, JP likes drama. Who called who's mama whore? Silly goose. Who called whose mother a whore, silly goose? All right? Look, even the heretics are turning against Sam. You got the heretics going, anyone who listens to Sam needs to check their heart. You got the heretics here, because this guy's a, a flaming heretic. Brother, me and you got to go one-on-one -on -one sometime. The irony. He's leading so many people to hell. A heretic telling... Uh, I mean, this is this is all messed up. This is all messed up. Anyways, talk about irony, man. A heretic telling Sam that he's going to hell. All right, let's carry on, fellas. Let's carry on. Common sense Christianity. I have no, I, I have no issues with you, but let's let's carry on. All right. So, fellas, check this out. Check this out. 
All I did, I pulled up on him. Now, fellas, if if somebody were scared of Sam Shamoon, would they pull up on his channel the way that I pulled up? Right in the comment section. If 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 I were scared of Sam Shamoon, would I have pulled up that way? Do y'all know me to be scared of anybody? Uh, common sense, this is not the place, but I did call you a heretic. I started it so we could talk in, in, a, in a Trinitarian live stream. But anyways, if you pull up on somebody, are you scared of them? Like, th this guy is, 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 is out of control. All right, let's carry on. I'm going to give you the link to come and debate me on Mary, because I know you want to slander thinking you're a Christian, so I can stuff you. Slander, right? Slander. You know that I'm not the only Christian. I'm not. Yes, that's the only person I'm scared of, Reamer. That is the only one man. But let me tell you guys something. He said that I'm slandering Mary. Slandering Mary how? Slandering Mary how? Because I said that she had sex with her husband. So that means that every single Christian that believes Mary had sex with her husband believes that Mary is a whore? What? You with your vomit. Shut your mouth. You're a dog. I have no respect for you until you repent. If you aren't that stupid and chime in the last 10 minutes, but listen, I already destroyed that argument. So shut up and stop barking you. So this, I came in the chat to see what the heck happened and I made a comment on something and he started manifesting. And all I did was I wanted to see what the heck the beef was. Coward. You ran from I don't know what I don't know because you lied. You said you debated him. Okay, so there you have it. He said I ran from I don't know what I don't know. All right. He said he said I ran from I don't know what I don't know. A mentally ill man. He's mentally sick, fellas. Go go on his channel if you can find it. I'm not going to endorse it. Listen to him for five minutes. Come back and tell me if he's not mentally sick. He's ill. He's sick in the head. OK, fellas. So we're going to leave him alone. We're going to leave him alone. He's ill. All right. But let's carry on. You hid like a little female dog behind Marlon Wilson. I hid like a female dog behind Marlon Wilson when I went and told Marlon Wilson that I wanted to run Sam Shamoon a fair one because if I didn't, Sam, Sam Shamoon is going to prove my point on why I wanted to run him a fair one behind Marlon Wilson. Okay? You better come up. And debate me so I can bury your slander against Mary because you want to. My slander against Mary. Where did I slander Mary? Where did I see? Brother, even if I were to say that you're correct, right? Let's say that you are correct. Me saying that Mary had sex with her husband, right? Her husband is not a sin. It's not a sin. And it's not blasphemous. It's not anything. That doesn't make Mary a whore. It just doesn't. The Bible says a man and a woman having sex in marriage is a holy thing. The marriage bed is undefiled. All right? Accuser being a sinner like your mother. Shut your mouth, you dog. You either come up or go to your vomit until you apologize and repent, you filthy, wicked tool of the devil. I have no respect for you. Shut up. Now, coming back to the issue, if all men doesn't mean everyone, then why refer to the believers in distinction from all men if you're not hammering the point that God wants every human to be saved and God is the savior of every human being, especially a believer, because they've experienced his salvation unlike the rest. So anyways, I come in in a bit, so stay patient. God wants to save them if they turn to him. Okay? Filthy scum dog. He thinks he knows the Bible. Another product of the Reformation, a bastard dog who thinks he's qualified to teach the Bible, 
when he's a dog. I have no respect for you, you filth, until you repent. So shut your mouth before I take you out, you coward. All Christians do is argue with each other. Is Are you making a factual statement? Aspiring say? Is, is your statement correct? Are you factually correct that all Christians do is argue with each other? Plus, I don't even think Sam Shimon is saved. That's up for debate. So technically speaking, I'm debating with, I'm, I'm arguing with a non-believer. All right. So are you making a factual statement? Like, is this, is this a factual statement? But let's carry on. I'll slander your mother for you thinking that you're honoring the Lord by slandering Mary. Your mother's not good enough to lick Mary Sandals, you son of the devil. All right. So all I said was, all I said was, again, Mary had sex with her husband. You filth. But anyway, for the rest of you, ignore this dog. He's not a friend. All right. Did you catch 1 Timothy 4.10? All men, especially a believer. What is he saying? God is the savior of all men, especially believers. Why? Because believers have experienced the salvation of God when they believe. But the rest haven't yet because they haven't turned, though God wants to save them too. Good. Now we're going to bury this dog. All right, so now I pull up on him. Now I pull up on him. So now here you have it. I pull up on the guy. I'm not as let me get the record straight here. I'm not scared of anybody. Do you guys see the way I be talking on Facebook? Like for those of y'all that have me on Facebook, do you see the way I be talking? Do I look like I'm scared of anybody? For the exception of 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 Reamer? I'm afraid of Reamer. That man's lungs, he can I would I was afraid of Reamer ever since I saw Reamer do a five to seven hour debate. I said, I can't keep up with somebody that can go five to seven hours. I, I can't do it. I know my limitations. I can't do it. But for the rest of you regular human beings, do y'all see the way I be talking on Facebook? Do y'all see the way that I be doing five on ones? I, I, I don't do one on ones, fellas. I'll do five on ones. I'll get five people to debate me by myself. All right, fellas? So the man's saying pull up, pull up, but this is the reason I wanted to do it on Marlon's channel. Come on up. Hello, Sammy boy. Hello, queer. So I go, hello, Sammy boy. Now let's go to scripture so I can bury you and your mother as you try to slam. No, 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 no. Let me ask you a question. If I can't ask you a question. So he kicks me out. So the man wanted to go to Bible, but he didn't want me to ask a question because he'll give up ground. So it's very simple, fellas. Guys like this, and I don't want to, I don't want to cross the line, but we know guys like that in New York. Like this guy, this guy is not tough. Like in New York City, we know this type of guy. If you're from New York, we all know that guy. Sam Shamoon is that guy that, that, that thinks he's tough and he can dominate. You can't let them dominate. You can't show fear. You can't show anything because they're not going to do anything. They're not, they're not really going to do anything. They, have, they need control. Sam is not tough, fellas. He's not tough. He's not. So this, we all know this type of guy. We all, if you're from the hood, if you're from the hood, we know that Sam Shamoon type of guy. We all know that. We all know that guy. You know that doesn't that doesn't work on us. So, anyways, carry on. Shut up. Get your Bible open, you son of a whore. We're gonna debate, Mary. The question I was gonna ask is: Can you show me in the Bible where Mary is a whore if she had sex with her husband? And can you show me in the Bible? where two married people are classified as whores for having sex with each other. That's what I was going to ask him. Then we would, we would open up the Bible and see where he can prove his case because he made the claim that I called Mary a whore. So if you're going to make that claim, you have to show me in the Bible where a woman who had sex with her husband is classified as a whore because that's all I'm saying is that Mary, who was a wife to a husband, Right. Husband and wife had sex with each other. And and uh, yeah, th there we go. This is Jose. He's from New York, bro. These guys like that, bro. They 
Things happen to guys like that, metaphorically speaking. Things happen to guys like that. You know, this guy's not tough. Like I said, sign the contract. We could do a, a little UFC fight, me and you. A little UFC fight. All right? But anyways, anyways, let's carry on. We This guy's not even a believer. Jose's not a believer. I knew Jose when I was a teenager. We know guys like this. We know guys like this. All right? So anyways, I was going to ask him, can you show me in the Bible where someone is classified as a whore if they have sex with their husband? Okay? That was going to be my question. But Sam Shamu knows that if I would have went that direction or any direction at all, he was going to get barbecued. So he had to dominate. Open up your Bible. Ah! Brother, are you out of your damn mind? Let's carry on. Grace purity. Don't bark. I'm telling you, you filthy coward. If God <laughs> is your father, open your Bible. No, 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 you bastard. And we're going to talk about Mary. You got your Bible? I'm going to bring you up. You got your Bible? I'm a, Look at this guy's face. Let, let, let's take a moment and look at this guy's face. Big titty Sam Shamoon. Let's look at his face. This is a man that thinks he's winning. He's like, I have control here. L look at this. Big titty Sam Shamoon. You're not tough, bro. You're not that guy. Let's carry on. Let's carry on. Question. Open the Bible. Can I ask you a question? Open the Bible. To Let the me passage. ask you a question. Again, I'm not giving up ground. Let me ask you a question, Big Titty. Before we open up the Bible, we have to get started. So let, okay. let's, let me son ask you a question. Son of Satan. Open the Bible to the passages where you think Mary's like your mother. Open it up. Before we do that, we have to open the something. Bible, you son of a whore. I'm going to call your mother a whore if you don't open the Bible. So, so look, fellas, this is two different ball games, right? I'm trying to have a debate. He's calling my mother a whore. He's calling me a dog. He's he's calling me all of these things. I'm playing I'm playing softball. He's playing baseball, right? So he's he's coming at me on a personal level, and all I'm doing is saying, "Let me ask you a question," right? Let me ask you a question. I'm not afraid of this dog. No way. I'm not afraid of anybody. Like, come on. The Bible. Well, no, 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 you bastard. And we're going to talk about Mary. You got your Bible? I'm going to bring you up. Question. Open the Bible. Can I ask you a question? Open the Bible. To let the me passage. ask you a question before we open up the Bible. We have to get started. So let, okay. let's, let me son ask you a question. Son of Satan. Open the Bible to the passage. Do you see this tactic? Open the Bible. Brother, I'm a veteran, brother. I'm from New York City, bro. We're, we're born debating, brother. We're born debating Knicks basketball, bro. Born, bro. Out the womb debating Knicks basketball, bro. I was five years old debating Knicks basketball against grown men, brother. You think we don't know people like you, bro? And Jose can vouch. Jose can vouch. Peter, not today. You're not breaking my balls today, Peter. I'm putting you in timeout because you're my guy, but uh, not today. You're not breaking my balls today. You can break my balls any other time, Peter. You know I love you, but today I don't want. I want my 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 uh, balls intact. Okay, all right. Nick's taking it every year. That's what I'm saying, fellas, fellas. I was born and raised in New York. Those tactics do not work. There are Sam Shamoons all over New York City, right? This is not Texas. This is not. This is not Delaware, or or this is not. Let me see. This is not a uh, Oklahoma. This is not what well, other states? Maryland. I mean, I think there, I think there's some debaters in Maryland, but they don't have a basketball team. But this is not. Let me see. This is this is not Canada, right? We're not in Canada. We're not in North Dakota, fellas. I'm from New York. I'm from New York City, kid. There's Sam Shamoons all over the place, bro. All over the place, brother. Messages where you think Mary's like your mother. Open it up. 
Before oh, wait. we do that, we have to open the something. Bible, you son of a whore. I'm going to call your mother a whore if you don't open the Bible. All right. So let me ask you a question. Again, I'm not. Don't you think I'm a fold? Let me ask you a question, Big Titty. Open the Bible. You got 10 seconds. Show me the verses that you think Mary's like your mother. Okay. Before we go there, Nine, I have to. Eight, seven, seven, six, six five, five, four, four three, three, four. And that's it. He kicked me out. So this is why I hide behind Marlon, right? JP preaches, brother. I go, I go to Pride Parade, fellas, in New York City, and I tell all the people in Pride to repent. In the middle, while Sam Shamoon stays in his bathroom. Well, fellas, I'm really out there, fellas. I'm I'm really, really out there. Like the people that know, they know. Like Sam should just drop this because it's just not gonna go very well for the guy. It's just not. If Sam Shamoon wants to go to war with me, I would love to go to war with that guy. But if he drops it, I'll drop it. I'm from New York City, fellas. Sam Shamoon has no... Y'all ever played Pokemon? And then, and then a Pokemon attacks another Pokemon, and it says that the attack is not effective? It says not effective. Right? In the Pokemon games, Sam Shamoon's attacks do not affect me. And if he wants to do a fight, if he wants to fight me UFC style, we can sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. All right? Like, like who, does, who does this guy think he is? Like who, does, like, who does this guy think he is? Like, who does he think he's talking to? Ask about me in New York, bro. There are people that follow you that know me from New York and ask them who I am, brother. We can do this however you want to do it, bro. However you want to do it, we can do it, bro. All right, let's carry on. Shut up, you whore. Stupid whore. Get that out of you whore. Your mother's the whore, not Mary. Mary is blessed, and your mother is not good enough to lick her sandals. You filthy whore. Don't respect this guy. He wants to debate on Mary because he thinks Mary's like his mother. But you see the dogs, they bark, they can't debate. I the dogs bark and they can't debate. I came in there and I asked you a question. You wouldn't let me answer. Tough boy. Big boy. I want to ask you a question. Did your mother ask the Shia question when they did muta with her? All right. Filthy whore. Anyway, for the rest of you, you guys. Filthy whore. Ask the dogs, they bark. There we go. There we go. Thank you. My thing is this. Actually, I'm glad that the mic was muted because I regretted what I said. See, that's the Lord. That's the Lord. So now I can say it more respectfully. Thank you, fellas. Thank you. How are you going to call somebody fat? Thank you, Lord, that my mic was muted. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. How are you going to call somebody fat? And then have the nerve to be fat yourself. Like this, this, this means a, a hypocrite. This, this means a hypocrite. A flaming hypocrite. And bro, you know what's, what's terrible about Sam Shamoon? Sam Shamoon cannot attack me. Do you know why? Because the vast majority of Christians believe I'm a Christian. In other words, he can't go to other Christian YouTubers and say, yo, JP's this, JP's that. They're going to all vouch for me and say, yo, JP's a believer. Can no one in the internet say I'm not a believer? Catholics will tell you, Calvinists will tell you, Pentecostals will tell you, Orthodox will tell you, everybody will tell you I'm a believer. Everybody will tell you I'm a solid man. That's not the case with Sam Shamoon. That is not the case with Sam Shamoon, fellas. That is not the case. It's not the case. So let's carry on. Let's carry on here.
bark, they can't debate. I want to ask you a question. Did your mother ask the Shia question when they did muta with her? You see, you see. So look at that attack. You look at that attack. You see what I'm saying? So th this is pretty much disgusting. This is pretty much. I enjoyed how JP holds his ground. Okay, let me ask you a question. You did great with the same question. You're muted, JP. Absolutely. Absolutely. Jose said where he's from. Yeah, Jose, I'm going to give you a moderator status. Give me a second, Jose. I'm going to give you a moderator status. So give me a second. Jose, where you at? Where you at, Jose? All right. Jose is a moderator on this channel. So there we have Jose. Jose is a moderator. And uh, there you go. Welcome, Jose. There you go. Okay, I accidentally clicked on the wrong page. All right, there you go. There you go. All right, so let's carry on. Let's carry on. All right, filthy whore. Anyway, for the rest of you, you got it here? You understand? So, guys, don't respect dogs who think they know the Bible and they respect Jesus by thinking they're going to slander Mary thinking that Mary's like their mother. Okay, anyway. Now, did you understand 1 Timothy 4.10? Do you understand 1 Luther, 1 Timothy 4.10? If Paul, so all men is not limited to believers, fear of everyone, salvation, are those who believe to believe. We got that. Now, let's end it with Charles Hans, filthy dog, filthy bastard. We got that. Now, let's end it with Charles Hans Spurgeon, filthy bastard. Trying to slander the Blessed Mother. Yeah, look at this flame. I, I'm going to barbecue this Catholic right now. Peter, my man, I'm telling you in love, I'm going to block you. You're on his sack talking about he's fat. Why don't you keep the same energy when he calls Anthony Rogers fat? When he calls Kelly Powers fat? Why don't you keep that same energy? But now that we're calling him fat, now you're saying we're on his sack? Bye, Peter. Bye. I'll unblock you one day. I'll unblock you one day. This is not a permanent block, but 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 you're bugging out. Now you're bugging out because you just lost your credibility. Hey, hey, look, look at Jose. Look at Jose. This is my man. This is my man's right here. You're on his sack for protecting him, Bozo. Now, he's not a Christian, but this is the guy I came up from. You know what I'm saying? I learned how to debate from that guy. Look at him. He's already he's already back on it. He already turned it on you. You know what I'm saying? And he's not a Christian either, fellas. So be very careful. Be very, very careful. All right. So, fellas, once again, once again, now he calls me a dog and he calls me all of these things. So let's let's go here. Filthy dog. Your mother may be the whore, but Mary is holy and pure, purified by her son. I know you're upset because your mother's not like that. Not good enough to lick Mary Sandals, you filthy dog. Why does anyone give you a platform, you son of the devil? Uh, why does anybody give me a platform? Uh, yeah, because uh, I'm a Christian. <laughs> I'm a Christian, brother. People actually love me in the Christian community. They do. Brother, I, there's nobody that goes after Calvinist doctrine more than me. Even if you're going to say Leighton Flowers. Leighton Flowers doesn't do what I do. Leighton Flowers does not do what I do. Leighton Flowers will never call Calvinism another gospel. And he will never debate the point. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. And I still love my Calvinist homies. We joke around and we drink non-alcoholic beer. Because it's not personal. We're just debating doctrines. And that's it. I never called the Calvinist. I never said his mother was a whore, ever. We're going to do an after show on Praise This Channel in the one, on, in the one hour mark. So we're going to finish this and then we're going to Praise This Channel. Praise, you want to come up here real quick, Praise, and just say a couple of words just so that you could tell people. So we're going to go on Praise This Channel after this and I'm going to close this out in the one hour mark. But this is this is this is what you call a barbecue, fellas. Yeah, look at this guy. Stop talking behind people's back and debate him. Brother, I pulled up on his channel. I pulled up on him. 
<laughs> I pulled up on him. DP the card. I pulled up on him. And here we have praise. Let me tell you guys something about praise. Now, this is going to bring me to tears. This is going to bring me to tears. This man prays, uh, JP, you're my guy, and I'd die for you, JP. Obviously, metaphorically speaking, I would never expect praise to die for me. And I would do the same for praise, obviously. Right? Uh, I would die for praise. I would die for praise. But praise, you don't have to die for me. If I die, I'll be in heaven. And so you lose out, I don't. So I'll die for you, but praise, you better not die for me. So let's let's get that clear. I'm glad we got that clear. But let me tell you, praise said that on his channel. He said, JP, that's my guy. And when Sam Shamoon did what Sam Shamoon did, praise said, JP. I support you 100%. I don't give a dang about views. I don't care what he does on my channel. I don't get, care about the traction. He said, JP, you're my guy. I said, don't do it, praise. I said, praise, don't do it. He goes, JP, what do you mean? I said, praise. Why would you sacrifice that relationship for me? Your channel is growing. You're getting the traction. He said, I don't care about the views, JP. I don't care about the likes, JP. I don't care about none of that, JP. He said, I have your back, and I'm cutting ties with Sam Shamoon right now. Is that not a friend, fellas? Everybody drop a like or a, or, or a, or a, a one or a clapping emoji for praise. Is that not a friend right there? A man that gave up all the views, subscribers, all the crap. He said, I don't give a damn, JP. I don't care if Sam Shamoon has 300,000 subscribers. I would never allow another man to talk to you like that. You're my boy. The hell with the views. Is that not a real friend right there? It almost brings me to tears. He said, forget that, JP. You may have 4,000 subscribers. Sam may have 300,000 subscribers. I would never turn my back on you, JP. That's what Praise told me on the phone. It almost brings me to tears, man. Go ahead, Praise. <clears throat> You're my homie, JP. You know that I would die for you. You're you're a brother, and uh, you know any other brother or sister out there too. And I just think that um, you know it's an unfortunate situation because Sam has so much potential. Like just imagine, like what he would do if he focused in the right way, and like demeaning people like that and insulting people, especially their family, crosses the line. And, uh, you know, Sam, like if you're listening, you know, one thing I, the one thing, even I would say, you know, of course your gospel's uh, off base, but I would say the number one thing to repent of is your derogatory insults to others and abusing people. It's, it's a type of mental abuse. So, you know what, man, like that's, and see, I love my brothers and sisters so much. I, you know, we're, we're called to die for them and I would do that. So. No, yeah, yeah. And here we have Noriega. He says, welcome to the group of us who have been cursed out by Sam. God bless you. Uh, to the Catholics that are here, I'm going to ban you, fellas. I am going to ban you. I will ban you if you're a Catholic here. If you're breaking balls anyways, if you're breaking balls. Uh, and then you will be unbanned later because I don't have any issues with you guys. But if you break balls, uh, you know, that's pretty much it. All right, praise. When do you have your channel for? When do you have your channel for? Because uh, I'm gonna, we can head over there now. And um, uh, I haven't said for uh, ten fifteen, but if if you were thinking something earlier, I'm cool with that too. Ten fifteen, like you mean? Oh, oh, your time. So it'll be eleven fifteen your time. Okay, so one hour from now. Okay. Right. Uh, if you want to do it for ten forty, which is my, t I don't know if, what your schedule is looking like. But if you want to do it for 10, four, that's going to be 15 minutes from now. Would you like to do it 15 minutes from now? Because I I, yeah. I think I barbecued this guy. There's not much to say. The guy's not saved. He's an animal. He's an animal, right? You see the way he talks to me? This uh, all, all because, and somebody said, JP, would you debate Sam with Kelly Powers? Absolutely. What's the topic? The topic is going to be, is Mary a whore if she sleeps with her husband? That's the topic. I'm not debating anything else other than that topic because I was slandered and I was utterly made to look ugly and bad. And Sam Shimon, don't say I'm ugly.
Because if you say I'm ugly, that means you're very ugly. <laughs> you're, not, you're not more handsome than I am, Sam Shimon. We could throw each other up in a modeling contest. You're going to come out <laughs> short every time. So, Sam Shimon, you have no rights to call me ugly. You have no rights to call me fat. <laughs> All right? <laughs> that's hilarious. And that's what, praise. I wish God would give me 30 minutes to say what I wanted to Sam without being held accountable. Right. Sam will be right here. I'll be right here. Roasting session. 30 minutes. And God says, hey, JP, you will not be held accountable for 30 minutes. If you go in a second more than 30 minutes, I will hold you accountable. But I wish God were to give me that grace because, bro, I will toast that. Man. In a roasting session? That's another thing we do in New York City. We do roasting sessions in New York City. All right? We do roasting sections, sessions in New York City. All right, so fellas, in 15, uh, praise, uh, can you change that time or not? Yeah, I can change it. That's cool. I'm good with that. All right, so fellas, we're going to head over to uh, this show right here as soon as he changes the time. And then we're going to do an after show over there. And if you're a Catholic, if you have any issues with what I said, if you have any kind of uh, uh, problems or anything, feel free to click on that thing. And if you're Sam Shamoon and you join Praise I Am's channel, Right. And if you join Praise I Am's channel, the debate is going to be, and again, the debate is going to be, is Mary a whore if she sleeps with her husband? That's the debate. Because that's the claim you made on me. Okay. So I'm not debating Mary and Dogmas. You lost your opportunity. I tried. I tried today. You, you kicked me out in 10 seconds. I asked you for a formal debate. You called my mother a whore. And you keep taking these cheap shots at me. And then you try to leverage somebody with mental health issues to try to push your agendas. Again, God will hold me accountable for every word that I say. So I will not violate you here today. I will not. But uh, but that's that. Sam, look at how many people here do not like you. You know what I'm saying? Standing for truth, please do not say anything. In fact, I'm going to delete this comment. Let me tell you why. Because if, if SFT says anything, then he'll be called standing with Lucifer. So I don't want standing for truth saying anything. Because standing for truth, I do not want you to be called standing with Lucifer. I do not want it. That'll pain my heart. I do not want you to get involved. You're my homie. I love you to death but I do not want you to be called standing for Lucifer. I do not. I mean, this is ridiculous at this point. It's ridiculous. So again, SFT, uh, you know, um, I don't want you to be called standing for Lucifer. By the way, I have a couple of debates coming up on SFT that we're working on. So fellas, stay tuned for that. I might be debating a free gracer and I might be debating Seiko Woods on that channel. Uh, so yeah, so did you fix it yet or not, brother? Yeah, it's fixed. It's we're good to go. All right. So if you want to start leaving, you can get over there. But before you do, brother, before you do. Yeah. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. <laughs> Sign the contract, <laughs> big boy. Sign the contract. <laughs> Yo, Jose, I'm, I'm about to pull up on somebody else's show right now, so I'm going to send all of you guys the link. Fellas, I'm going to be right here. This is where I'm going to be. I'm going to be right here. All right, man. I'm going to head over there. God bless my brother. Great stuff, and we'll see you soon. All right, fellas. I'm going to be right here. All right. So, fellas, I'm going to be right here. This is going to be Praise's channel. If you want to have a conversation with me, if you want to talk with me, if you want to prove me wrong, you go ahead and prove me wrong. Fellas, I don't run from anybody. Well, God bless you. Jose, we're going to have you on the channel one day, Jose. We're going to talk about Christianity and things of that sort. So hopefully one day you come to Christ, my brother, you know, and I will continue to pray for you. But, uh, but yeah, uh, let me send the link. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let me give you all my Instagram, fellas. Let me give you all my Instagram. Give me one second. I actually am on Instagram. Now, the thing with Instagram is that I'm only on Instagram for like a week at a time, and then I deactivate it. But right now, I am on Instagram. So, fellas, you guys can drop a, uh, you guys can hit me with a follow on Instagram. That is my Instagram. Uh, hit me with a follow, fellas, and uh, you know, 
I'll be there from time to time. So hit me with a follow on Instagram, all right? And uh, we're going to be here. So here, here we are, fellas. Here we are. And this is where I'm going to go. We're going to wait for praise. And as soon as praise starts, then uh, we'll do our thing. We'll do our thing. Uh, you guys have any questions? Because praise has a couple. Praise has about 11 minutes. So if you guys have questions, you guys can ask those questions. And, um, you know, I love to, I love to, to, you know, to talk. So, you know, pretty much done. I mean, there's not much to say, man. I mean, there's not much to say. At the end of the day, Sam Shamoon can't say anything about me. All he can do is call my mother a whore, call me, uh, say that I am, that I'm attracted to the opposite sex. Uh, say that I'm stupid, that I can't debate, and I don't know my Bible. That's all he could do. That's all he could do. So, you know, that's that's all that it is. You know what I'm saying? If not, then I'm pretty much out of here. Just wasting time waiting for praise. That's it. Your victory. If you don't show up to praise this channel, I'm going to personally be offended. Personally. Talk about the spirit of offense, right? Now, I wonder where I put my phone. But, uh, but yeah, don't sit around here. You know what this, this mentally ill person said? He said, JP openly said on a platform that he fabricates drama. <laughs> when the heck did I ever say that? Uh-oh, Reamer asked, Reamer asked. If the OG says sign the contract, then I got to sign the contract. So hold on, fellas. Hold on. Sorry, man. If you guys are tired of hearing this video, blame Reamer. Let me find them one more time. I should download that video and uh, make it, make it, uh, you know, make it a thing. All right, fellas, here we are. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. <laughs> Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. Where'd you guys debate? On his channel. Brother, you're going to have to rewind this. It was a 10-second debate. But, uh, you know. Sign the contract, big boy. Sign the contract. All right. So, fellas, I'll be here. Let me see. Let me post this. All right. Okay, so look. Look, the mentally retarded guy made a video. Let me show you guys something. So, look, look. JP on cut possessed by video game. Uh, if I drink this right here, if I drink this liquid, this poisonous liquid. So this guy, this guy made a video saying that I was possessed by a demon. This is what I say. This is what I said. This was my statement, just to get the proper context. If you're a Christian and you play with satanic things, you play. Suppose that I'm a Christian. And I go to, to, to the house of, of Satanism and I start drinking blood and I start to do satanic things or I'll play satanic video games, right? I believe you can have a demon that way. Just is what it is. You play with Satan, you get Satan. And I was playing a video game that was very satanic. That was very, very satanic. And I felt like I caught something. Especially after the Holy Spirit told me not to play the game. You play with Satanism, you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna get got. Simple as that. Simple as that, my friend. Simple as that. So there you have it. All right, so once again. This is where we'll be at.
I actually, I actually would like Sam Shamoon to say that I have demons. Because if Sam Shamoon says I have demons, oh, I'm going to have so much fun. Oh my goodness, I'm going to have so much fun. I will pull up every clip that this man manifested and we'll put my clip side by side and we'll see who has the demons. We'll see who has the demons. All right, fellas? All right. Let's see let's see uh what the deal is here. Let's see praise I am. Where's praise I am? Praise I am. All right. He'll be starting in seven minutes. He'll be starting in seven minutes. All right. I got the StreamYard link. All right. So, uh, fellas, I'm going to start headed out now. I'm going to start headed out. Praise is going to be starting in five minutes. So one more time, we'll be there. We'll be there. All right, fellas, we'll be there. And um, yeah. Oh, shoot. The super chats. A uh, new member. And let's get Sam a bra. All right, I'm out of here.